So, hello. This is number 38 on the NMAT sample exam. So, we will compute for the total resistance, the equivalent or the total resistance, and the total current or the current flowing through the circuit. So, for the total resistance, we follow these rules, these formulas. Okay, so let's compute. Let's first compute this part. This part. This is a parallel circuit. So to compute that, we will have 1 over R total is 1 over 8 plus 1 over 8. Or simply, you have 2 over 8 or 1 fourth. But please remember, this is 1 over R and this is 1 fourth. So the reciprocal of that is R is equal to 4. Okay, so we have R is equal to 4. So therefore, this is 4 ohms. Hence, this is also 4 ohms. Now let's consider these two as these three as a series circuit. So we have here for this one, we have a total resistance of a total resistance of four ohms plus twelve ohms plus four ohms, and that is twenty ohms. So that is our total resistance in this area. So we have here 20 ohms. Now, this one also is a series. So this four and four. So you just add them. Um, this is four ohms plus four ohms. You have a total of eight ohms. That is our total resistance in that part. Now, as you observe, I'll just redraw it. It will actually look like this. You have a circuit that has 8 ohms here and 20 ohms here. Parallel resistors, parallel resistors with 35, 35 volts. That would be our total voltage. Okay, so let's compute for this one. This is a parallel circuit so 1 over r is 1 over 8 plus 1 over 20 let's do for the lcd the lcd there is i think 40 because we times 5 this times 5 we will times 2 this so that we will have 5 over 40 plus 2 over 40 so that would be our 1 over r is equal to 7 over 40. Or simply our R total is 40 over 7. So this should be our answer. Now in our choices, this is not an answer. This is not an answer. Our R should have these values. Ohms. Now let's go for the current. We will be using Ohm's law. Ohm's law formula states that, let's have red. Ohm's law formula states that V is equal to IR. Therefore, if you're looking for I, you can just divide V over R. So let's compute for the current. Our V here is given 35 volts. And our resistance, we've computed that 40 over 7 ohms. Let's just um, divide them by reciprocal of the denominator. I think we can cancel this. This will cancel out. This will be 7, 5 times 7. This is 8 times 5. So this would be 8. I canceled the 5, guys. So I will have 7 times 7, 49 over 8 amperes. And this is the answer. The answer is letter D. Thank you.